Merton's Anime Theory. Merton's theory of anime is built upon Durkheim's theory of anime. Merton was also a functionalist who believed that there are two important but different functions of deviance. The first type is called the manifest function. Manifest functions involve social outcomes that the actors intend. The second type of function is called the latent function. The latent function involves outcomes that are not intended by the actor. For example, a manifest function within your life may be working very hard to impress your boss. Your hard work may result in the desired outcome, but there may also be a latent function of working hard. It may lead to an unintended outcome, such as a decreased time to spend with your friends and family due to the extra time you put in to impress your boss. Merton came up with some interesting ideas regarding deviance. Check out Merton's anime theory of deviance. It states that since American society places enormous value on material success, people must adapt depending on where they stand with regard to these material goals. Also important is their access to acceptable means for achieving them. Begin by assuming that everyone would pursue these culturally defined goals if they could, but recognize that some people cannot. There may be many reasons that they cannot, but Merton focused only on those reasons that have to do with structured inequality. Some people cannot get good educations, cannot get good jobs, and so on. For these people, there are only limited possible choices. If people cannot pursue the material goals through acceptable means, then they have three choices. One, they can just give up. Merton called this retreatism. Two, they can follow the norms to the best of their ability, even though it will not lead to success. This is called ritualism. And third, they can pursue the goals through unapproved methods like stealing. This is called innovation. Rebellion is a fourth adaptation and involves the creation of new goals and new means of achieving these goals. So, instead of having the goal of monetary success, a person would create new goals for themselves, like pursuing communal peace. Make love, not war, right? If individual rebellions become widespread, revolutionary change could result. New goals would replace the existing goals, and there would be new goals for people to either conform to or rebel against. This theory is called anime theory because it focuses on confusion in values and norms. This confusion results from conflict between the values and goal, material success, and the unequal access to the normative means for achieving them. So there are five different possibilities for adaptation. One, the conforming to the goal of material success. Two, innovation. Three, retreatism. Four, rebellion. And five, ritualism. Part